Don't know why I'm drifting, I'm drifting so Out of my mind Hey guys, this is an X reading for the 22nd through the 29th and this reading is for all Tauruses and all placements primarily Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter guys if you guys are new, welcome, please like, share, subscribe, comment um, if you like the video let's see what's currently going on for Taurus's X Six of Swords trying to move on mentally um, I feel like this person probably has has been going through a lot of um, conflicting energy but now they're at a point where they are able to use their own resources in order to move on without actually having a conversation um, with you guys I feel this is Aquarius energy here let's see what is your access perception of you my Taurus friends what is the perception of the ex of Taurus? The world. Mm. Aries has these same two cards. You guys probably hear my kitty back there, Callie. Um, she's trying to get in. But um, your perception of you is that you guys belong together. Maybe some of you guys are actually dealing with an Aries. Um, or some of you may be on the cusp with Aries. But anyway, um, they feel like you guys belong together. They feel like um, even though you guys broke up that, or have probably broken up maybe before, that you always tend to come back together. Okay, because you know basically this is where this is where home is for them with you through the good and the bad times. So, but they also feel like you guys have taught them a lot being with you. Um, I feel like this person has really grown up, whoever this is. Maybe they acted very um, immature before, but I feel like this person has definitely grown. Okay. Let's see their feelings about getting back together. Oh, this is also Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, um, Leo energy here. Okay. X's feelings about getting back together. What are Taurus X feelings about getting back together? Page of Wands, they're definitely interested in it, most definitely. I feel like this is something that they've thought about. I don't see them taking any action um, per se towards you, but I definitely get that this person is definitely open to um, talking things out with you. Currently I see them moving on um, without having a conversation with you guys just um you know ready for a new start a new beginning okay what's currently blocking taurus's x what's blocking taurus's x page of swords they're not speaking much okay they probably are just um interested and they've thought about it but they're not actually taking any action or having a conversation with you guys right now okay Gemini leap Aquarius energy something like the flip over there what is the ex's next move what is the next move of Taurus's ex king of pentacles I feel like this person is more focused on their um, finances right now um, having control of their life in general Okay, but I don't get that this person is definitely a commitment um, type of person. This is not somebody that dates. They just date just to be dating. They date with a purpose. Um, but they're, I don't feel like this person is necessarily in a relationship, but I don't feel like um, they would turn down the opportunity if the opportunity was one that... Um, that seemed like it would be beneficial for them though okay 
So Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Let's see. It could definitely be a Taurus like yourself. <clears throat> or, or an Aries, Taurus, uh, Cusper. Please, okay. More information about the Six of Swords here. The Empress, yeah, this person's definitely working on themselves. Definitely. Um, I feel like they have there's something about their their livelihood their finances that has improved uh, significantly this person is probably a single mother or single father single single parent they have children um, that is taking some of their focus right now they have something else to concentrate on other than being in a connection um, yet and still this person is definitely open to it and I see that if the right opportunity presents itself. Again, Taurus, Libra, um, Aries, energy. Please show me more about the world energy. Two of Cups. They feel like you guys belong together, like I said. They definitely care for you. They have love for you. Um, they feel like you guys belong together. They're also doing something um, as far as in a business sense or career opportunity that has presented itself that they are um, getting a lot of enjoyment out of currently. What is the ex's feelings about getting back together? The ex's feelings about getting back together. Seven of Wands. Mm. They're kind of defensive. They, they are definitely interested in it. Um, but they are concerned with themselves first and foremost and, and really want to protect their interests, their personal interests. Um, I feel that this person may have blocked you or either communication is currently um, blocked with you or they feel like you guys have blocked them even. So that I believe that's probably why they're not, you know, um, just showing all of this interest and in speaking to you because they probably feel like you guys have blocked them or have blocked communication does not you don't want to have anything to do with them possibly okay so um, I'm getting definitely you guys haven't spoken in a while I feel a strong fire energy present for you please show me more about the page of swords And then we have a page of pentacles. Mm hmm They've contemplated speaking to you, but um, it's not moving forward. It's still in a very, um, the, the very initial stages right here. They think about it. Um, they're interested in it. And um, they feel like if you guys could talk, um, talk things out together that there is definitely a potential for longevity here but I don't get that there's any real conversation going on between the two of you please show me more about the King of Pentacles energy the Hierophant they are not moving um, they believe what they believe. They want what they want. They want something very traditional. They want somebody that's very supportive. Somebody that is willing to commit to them. Um, so they are basically standing their ground right now. Their next move is to wait for the right person um, to come into their life. Whether that's you guys or not, I can't say. Because I don't know who actually needs to make the first move here, but um, I don't see them doing anything other than um, what they're doing currently and really standing their ground and um, defending their beliefs and what they want. Okay, so definitely could be another Taurus like you guys. Um, Aries is very strong, I feel. Leo may be here as well. Um, maybe Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Scorpio energy, Cancer energies here. Yeah, so that's what I have for you guys and um, I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now. Uh, I've been blind too long, now I finally see The real and fake, who's down for me? Yeah. The situation
situation, wasting my time. I had enough, I'm tired of the lies. Blah, 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 da, 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 da. What are you saying?